Ronnie has given me a voice to, um, to share my story and also encourage um, Ronnie as part of the recovery process from addiction and alcoholism. I got into recovery because my life was spiraling downwards. I was reckless. My health was deteriorating. I found myself in urgent care five times with gastritis. My marriage was, was dwindling. My, my work wasn't going well. Every aspect of my life was kind of suffering. I knew that I had a problem deep down inside, and it was just only a matter of time before I, I gained the strength to actually get the help to seek help. I started running um, to kind of help my recovery process. When I run or exercise, it kind of helps the day flow better. So when I started running, I always wanted to push myself. If I said I was going to run eight miles, I'd go ahead and run 10. And so in my head, I'm like, I want to run a marathon. So I ran my first half marathon in October, my first year running, six months running. And as soon as I ran that marathon, I was hooked. I didn't know what else, I didn't know there was anything beyond the traditional 26.2. Before I knew it, um, I had signed up for my first ultra marathon. I did the Phoenix, the Mesa Phoenix Marathon four times. And then I did my first Boston Quad event. Yeah, it was like an 80 mile warm up because I had to start at the finish line, go to the starting line, come back to the finish line, go to the start line, and the fourth marathon was the actual marathon. It was one of the greatest days of my life. I thought it was a huge accomplishment. I started something bigger than, than, um, than I ever imagined. So I decided to sign up for a, found, for a foundation, a nonprofit organization called Runwell. Basically, they, um, they do running groups. To, they also encourage um, running as part of the recovery process from addiction and alcoholism. Um, and all the money that they raise, or anybody raises for Runwell, goes directly to, um, to treatment centers. Treatment's expensive, so people that can't necessarily afford treatment uh, will be given kind of like a scholarship to, to get help. And getting help and getting a treatment is ultimately saving their life. If you see somebody struggling, help them, encourage them to get treatment. And when you do that, sometimes you might find also that it's people just like you. I've been in recovery for a little over 10 years now. I'm proud of myself for being able to do, and I'm lucky, I'm humbled, I'm lucky to be able to do what I do. Running is a good way of keeping me sober because it's helped me physically, mentally. Um, I have more energy. Um, I just feel alive when I'm running.